Having the right domain name helps visitors find you online, adds credibility to your brand, and makes your site look more professional. There are a few things to keep in mind when choosing your domain name. I'm Carly, and that's what we're going to be covering in this video. First things first, make it memorable. Look for domain names that are short, easy to remember, spell, and pronounce. This is key for word of mouth marketing, so visitors can find your site when searching for it. Second, pick a domain name that includes your brand or something close to it. This will help strengthen your brand identity. Third, you want to avoid domain names that are keyword rich or simply too long. Take bestplantshopmiami.com. In the past, this may have been considered good practice, but today people and search engines view these types of domain names negatively. Instead, keep it short, catchy, and brandable. Fourth, avoid acronyms, numbers, and hyphens. Search engines don't like it, and frankly, it makes it difficult for people to spell. Fifth, you want to check to make sure your domain name doesn't infringe on any competitors before purchasing. Research copyright databases and competitor domain names to be sure you aren't using a similar name, even indirectly. This can cause customer confusion and in some cases can escalate to lawsuits, and we don't want that happening. Last but not least, choose the right suffix or extension for your domain. .com is the most common, but there are plenty others like .org or .net. Adding a local extension like .fr is a great way to boost local SEO. But if you're targeting an international audience, stick to a widely used extension like .com. Use these guidelines to choose a professional domain name that can evolve and grow with you. Once you connect your domain, you'll be able to instantly get your site listed on Google search results. That's all for today. Again, I'm Carly. Thanks for tuning in, and we'll see you next time.